whole swimming pool turns into like a tornado. I'm about to prank my sister. Oh my god. This is a bottle. This is a cat. I turned the cat. Wait, you you shake dead bro! You shake it! You lied! You told me I'm gonna say no cap after this. No cap! Gotcha. Welcome back to another video. So today is a special day. I got my brand new t-shirt on. Oh, it's a unicorn human. Subscribe, like, comment, share, and do all the good things in life. So today we're back with another TikTok life hack. We're gonna be teaching you how to make flavored watermelon. Yeah. All right, let's go. This is a watermelon. I'm gonna need the cameraman to take us through what we're gonna do. Bro, you're making the camera do an earthquake. <laughs> no way. Alright, hello! Alright guys, so I've seen this live back all over the internet. So, how it works is you're gonna need your different sodas and you're gonna put them upside down in the watermelon. Alright guys, so first things first, we're gonna have to put some holes through the watermelon. So now that you have a hole in your watermelon, what you're supposed to do is you're actually supposed to put your Coke or your Fanta or your Sprite upside down. And what happens is the watermelon is supposed to become soda flavored. Alright, we're just going to do like these round movements. Alright guys, so now that you have your holes inside the watermelon, this is about to get exciting. Oh. Ah! Oh. Ah! You idiot! You're the one that did that! Oh why would you try and pull off the head? Alright guys, so now that we have the holes inside the watermelon, this is where it begins. So you're going to want to put your sodas upside down in the watermelon. What the oh, hell? Bro, it. Bro, ah, bro, why are you doing bro, that? Bro. What the hell is wrong I don't know! Bro! You didn't, why is it doing that? I don't know. Why is it fizzing? Alright, next, next. Go next. Mom, can you hold it properly? All right, there you go. It's working. All right, Lana, explain what's happening. Somehow, the freaking Coke magically fizzed itself back again, even though there is no fizz in it. I don't know what type of experiment this is, but it does not make sense. Oh, my freaking God. Ah, ah. Can you hold that? Someone hold this. All right, let's, let's, that's it, that's it. It got flavor, it got the flavor. Take it out. Okay, guys, so now that we have the watermelon, Right now, we're gonna leave this for about five minutes and then we're gonna see how the watermelon tastes. Oh my god! That's all Coke! Alright, so it's been a while. Now we're gonna be opening the watermelon in half. Alright, it's time to see if we got a new flavor watermelon. Yeah, bro, can you, can you save at least the last bit of the Fanta? I wanna drink it. Thank you. Okay, all right, we're gonna so right now. We're gonna quickly remove all the drinks from the watermelon. Yeah Ready for another explosion. All right, we're gonna be cutting it open now. So here we go All right, we're gonna cut this bad boy open right now and Let's give it a little taste. I right, guess so now that we're trying the watermelon It honestly does taste a lot different with the Fanta and the coconut was this a good idea? I don't think so. Would you rather have this or normal watermelon? Bro, with the mess we created, obviously a normal watermelon. <laughs> okay, so now that you've seen the part with the Fanta, I'm gonna try the part with Coke and see if that tastes any different. It's basically watermelon that tastes like Coke, bro. <laughs> this is not a good combination. Imagine putting rice and Coke. Would it taste nice? No. Watermelon and Coke? Still no. Life hack number one. Mm -hmm. eh, eh, stupid, don't try it. Alright guys, moving on to life hack number two. Ooh, woo! Today I actually want to do something which I saw on the internet. I saw a video where a guy jumped in the swimming pool with a ball. And basically, if you tuck the ball in your chest, it flies in the sky about 50 meters. What? 
Bro, really? You could lose the ball. Bro, the, the ball is probably gonna go to the neighbor's house. We're about to see if we can make this ball fly in the sky. All right, I don't know if this is gonna work, guys. <laughs> Did it work? It's in front of you, idiot. Guys, it's not as easy as it looks. It needs a pretty good talent. Oh, it's not working. I think I need to be heavier. We're not giving up until this works. I have a nose piece. Are you ready? Oh, it kind of worked a bit more. Nope. <laughs> that was good? No, that was worse. Oh, god damn, bruh. You just put water everywhere. Step number two, we're gonna jump off the table. I don't think this is a good idea, but we're gonna try it. Table looks like it's about to break, bro. Just, okay, it's cracking. What are you trying to do? It's not over until I say it's over. I need to make this work. So we're gonna try it one more time with a rugby ball. Three, two, one. What? Whoa! Yeah, because you splashing everywhere, bro. So what I'm about to show you is gonna blow your mind. I'm actually gonna be making an underwater whirlpool. <laughs> bro, what are you doing behind the camera, guys? I saw my sister do this. She's like, eh, uh. bro, wait, what are you doing, bro? Are you okay? Wait. Are you okay? Stop, stop. See, you're making it stop. What is he doing? Do you think it's working? It's a blender. Yeah, it can't. Guys, yeah, that's right. Lana said we should use a blender at this point. Yeah, that's the dumbest thing ever. like a tornado. Yeah, Bro, the whole swimming pool turns into like a tornado. Oh, that is crazy! Bro! Guys, I know you saw that. That was a freaking tornado happening. I don't know what you call those things that turn in the water. Whirlpool. A whirlpool was happening on top of the water. That's how we're recording this. My mom is helping me. Woo! We did it! Oh! Alright guys, so that was the underwater tornado. If you guys want to know how to do that, make sure to subscribe. And if this video hits 70,000 likes, I will comment down below how to do this trick. Because it's actually pretty easy. So, for this TikTok life hack, I'm going to teach you guys how to get unlimited chocolate. Alright, so, guys, as you can see, we have a chocolate bar right here. Okay. Is this the same size, Lana? Yeah, obviously it is. All right, guys, so right now I have two equal size chocolate bars. Now, I'm gonna keep one of them on the side. This is what you're gonna do. So, we're gonna cut this right here. Oosh. And then, we're gonna make another cut just like this. Ooh. And now, we're gonna do this. Now we have one piece of chocolate on the side, which you guys can see, all right? The same piece of chocolate, all right, guys, look, it's the same piece. Now, I'm gonna take my free piece of chocolate and watch carefully, guys, look. We're gonna move this over here. Now, we're gonna move this piece over here. Voila. Same piece of chocolate. Guys, look at this. As a size reference, ta-da. You have one piece of chocolate over here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. You see? Now you can have your free chocolate. Very impressive. Well done.